chases down a leopard chases down the gazelle like the weakest gazelle yeah for humans it's opposite you know <laughs> not necessarily well no kind of in a sense if you're looking at it from that perspective but what I'm saying is well me and my guy friends we're like the lions we, we break up uh-huh. and we funnel them <laughs> and it's the process where like the ugliest girl she kind of is the weak the, the weaker Gazelle. So we leave her go. We don't eat her like they lions eat her. Uh-huh. Like we we keep chasing after the faster, stronger, hotter one. Therefore, you know, slowly by slowly we break in and one one guy swipes a girl down another and there's a few girls left and he's he just gotta come and make the prowl and pounce on her. And then I'm gonna stop because my mom's gonna smack me if I, if I continue. <laughs> From a barrier of awkwardness and just make you laugh. Like, that's my favorite thing to do. Like someone who's in like that classic old person who just hates the world and so bitter. Do I look like an old person? No, you are a stunning, beautiful, the, the version of Mary herself. Watch out, he's alive. Falling from heaven. He's had a he's had a lot of the good medicine. Yeah. Like I like when like there's an old woman who everyone thinks hates everyone, and then you just make her laugh. So you just gotta break it down and just cheer up. But you're not the old woman. You'd be more of the the Giselle Bunchen woman of, who was a little bit on a bad day, but I haven't been. Yeah, the earlier. You're gonna blackmail on the video. Process and all the spies and shooting and pee on it. Have you ever had anyone pee during surgery in their pants? Do you tell them about it? So, I can so you'll never know. Oh, my goodness, I'll be completely violated. <laughs> <laughs> eh, yeah, I don't know. Anyone ever pooped? No. Once in a while. Have you ever had anyone poop? Once in a while. Uh, see, I would have, I, if no one had done it, I would have tried to poop for you. <laughs> Not, like, for, for you, but, like, just another, like, like a good story breaker for combo. Like, we're going out on a date tonight. Like, oh, how's it going? The kid pooped in me today. That's a great week. And if he likes it, he's a winner. Definitely, definitely a hubby. And even if he's a little chubby. A hubby with a ch- chubby tubby. Hubby. I wonder if I could rap for a career or two. I saw that. <gasps> I just ripped it out. Oh, yeah, I got so scared. I have to pee. I'm going to pee my pants and surgery. We can give you a, a bottle to go in here. She can't get up because she's got too much of it. Well, that would make it even funnier. No, it's just Is my leaner going to work? Because I was in the bathroom the last time I got a block and I couldn't pee. Where was the block at, though? My shoulder. Um, I was okay. standing there like, and like it just like shot out sideways. I was like, what? And I peed all over the wall. All over the floor. And I just looked at the nurse and I go, I'm sorry. <laughs> I don't know. I mean, it should work just fine. <laughs> Did you realize that my parents won't even buy me a new car? Keep in mind, I'm not the smartest child in the household. Or the most athletic. But I feel like they laugh. Look at, look at this. She's laughing. So technically, I make her laugh so hard, that's a workout. She doesn't have to go to a gym anymore. Save money to gym. I, I, I'll give all my college savings money to them to pay for it. And then, like, they just continually will laugh at me, which is money. Which means when I'm still laughing at them, we could just bring it to cancel TV. Cancel TV, we just get free comedy. Did you see him yet? No, I see him here, though. 
How you doing, buddy? Wonderful, sir. How are you? Not doing well. Looks like you're doing pretty good, my friend, huh? You're zooming here, huh? <laughs> that's not the package A. I, won't, I can wonder what everyone's reaction would be like. Give us another patient here, that's all. <laughs> but they would just be shocked, and I would have been she would have given me a well, Your parents might be shocked. Look, she would have cut me right think, to the face. I think your dad, uh, this is going to be on YouTube tonight, my friend, so. <laughs> it's not that funny. <laughs> it's not that funny. Mark, my name is Ed. I'll be the nurse taking care of Tanya operating room. I'm going to ask you, can I see your ID bracelet? Okay, any allergies at all, Mark? Allergies to air. Air, okay. <laughs> you're can't doing, I can't have any air in my body. Doing, you're not doing good. I can see that by the pulse size. <laughs> What's that mean? You're doing good there. She said not to jiggle my finger, but that's all I've been doing. <laughs> any, any contact lenses, partial plates, dentures, watches, rings, any type of jewelry at all? Well, no. Any piercings or anything like that? I know what my dad is waiting for. Wait. He's waiting for it right here. What's that? You're going to ask if there's any metal in my body. Yeah. And I'm going to be like, well, Doc, we got a little bit of a problem. Because I've got abs of steel. <laughs> and I've got some serious cannons up here, you know? Firepower. If he needs it. Okay. <laughs> Can I get some more water? Oh, no, water. <coughs> you don't even want to drink out of this. It's not yet. Uh, what's Dr. Sauer doing? He's cutting up. Here, I guess. What'd you do? My metatarsal is not my toes. What'd you do here? Well, excuse my language. I may get really raging mad, but I'll hold it in for this woman. Because she doesn't deserve it because she refuses to tell me a new car. It doesn't even have to be new. Just like a little, not, not like the 15-year-old car I'm driving now with. I started off and it's got like hundreds of, uh, hundreds of thousands of miles on it. Ten miles a gallon. It's a tank. What? That's a safe car then. But yeah, but there's a there's an image. See, she wanted me to wear new shoes because I was student council president to school. And I was like, Mom, you're talking about image you want me going on here. She's like, Yeah, Mom. I was like, well, what are they going to think about me when they see me driving up in a, in a box? Well, they'll think they're safe. No, they'll think I'm trying to kill someone and then get away with it, because no one's going to suspect that ugly of a car. Like, it literally goes to 70 miles an hour and shakes. Well, it has to gather speed. That's what, that's what they want. What kind of car do you want? What do you want? A black F-150, four-wheel drive, with a crew cab, short bed. Now everyone's like, oh, the short bed, oh, what are you going to do, carry on it? But see, if I get the extended bed, there's not enough room to park in the garage. But the crew cab, I can still carry. You just extend the garage for it, that's all. No, no, that's not realistic. I, I still care for him. still care for him? Yeah. All I'd ever wanted. All right, listen to my life story here, Doc. I grew up wanting a dog. For nine years, all I asked for every Christmas, every birthday, every holiday... I went through every holiday of every religion, and on that holiday of that religion, I probably want a dog. Uh huh. Any kind of dog. You know what my parents do to me? What do they do to you? They get my family a dog, so it's not my dog, and I don't get to. I didn't get to name it. We'll get you dog today. You know. You know what they named it? What they name it? Shore. Shore. Yeah. For sure. Like like the dog like the ocean shore. Oh okay, well that's unique. And I was like, are you kidding me? Name her after a beer or something? That'd be funny. What kind of dog? What kind of dog? What kind of dog do you have? It's a little beagle. Oh, okay. So cute. She's so stupid. Oh my god. <laughs> if she doesn't eat her food, she's afraid to eat her freaking food bowl. She cries and cries. They pour it on her floor. Do you have any questions, Mark? Are you, are you warm enough? I have a weird sensation running through my body, actually. Following that medication they gave you. I feel like Spider-Man. <laughs> Are you recording all this, Dad? You won't believe it. Tomorrow morning, I'll never believe it. I said, I said, what? He's <laughs> right at you. Now's the time to ask any questions that you want to answer. <laughs> Or not know the answer to it. That you don't, yeah, right. They never would tell you the answer before. Now you get it out of it. I smoke a pack a minute. I do tons of heroin. I snort it all. No, that's not heroin. That's something else.
Yeah. I convinced my mom I snort drugs doing this thing called the Russian vacuum. It's quite hilarious, my friend. <laughs> she like she got she was furious, she was ready to shoot me. And then like I crushed up like smarties and ran them down the length of the table. I was like, they call it the Russian vacuum, because in Russia, they smacked their face on the table and then snorted all the way up back with both nostrils. <laughs> it's like a big vacuum effect. She starts hitting me, hitting me, and uh, you know, no. abuse is very yeah. often that in my was household. It, uh, you, weren't, you weren't physically abused? <laughs> oh, she was punching me and kicking me. And, uh, I can't even... This is all on tape. Uh, that's right. How long do you have to go? How many, how many hours can you go with that? I don't know. <laughs> I feel like I'm sleeping, but I'm awake. Mm-hmm. So this happens, this is a football injury. Someone step on your foot. Yeah, I, wanna, I hate that kid. I hate him forever. I hate him. Number 12. No, 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 no. <clears throat> yep, I'm ready. Well, as soon as Dr. Sauer gets here and talks to you and marks your foot, we'll take it back and get started. Any, any questions? Anybody? <laughs> Can we keep him here overnight? <laughs> Do you guys take off? Wait, 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 you missed that moment's fun? You missed that moment's fun? Well, we go home and he gets violently ill. We took got, him home last night. He got violently ill. Oh, well, you speak to this young lady here for anesthesia. You guys, you guys, you guys, take my, you you guys right? take my, my we can't prevent it when we take him home. Well, <laughs> oh, no, by me. <laughs> What's up? Uh, what do you have done to number four? You're real sick. I'm a snake. Um, I'm a little bit of a snake. It's 12 o'clock. Last October. I'm in mean, your garden. Uh-huh. Yeah, what do you get sick from? The, the, maybe it was the medication again for pain or something? Or? I don't know what it was. He felt nauseous the whole time. He got sick in the hospital before he left and then he just was. My throat record is seven feet <laughs> distance. <laughs> Through a screen door. He had reflux when he was a baby. Get at me, Holmes. Keep it real. All right, Mark, we'll be with you shortly here. Enjoy the ride. <laughs> you know, I feel like if you guys did this to me before football, I could finish the season. <laughs> I'm sure you could. <laughs> you literally could hit me with a freight train and I'd be like, good one. <laughs> Are you an Eagles fan? Or a- Eagles, baby. I'm going to hold it against you. Eagles and Yankees. You don't like either? But Eagles fan. Now, they, now Kansas City. Long time Kansas City fan. Yeah, that's <laughs> Long time. <laughs> Are you from that area? No, not, actually not. But I just, yeah, 